it's Joseph, and I'm going to do a blind opening of two packs of 1992, the Todd McFarlane era Spider-Man trading cards. I got these off eBay for a couple of bucks, and the mailman actually delivered them next door. And he told me he delivered them next door, but he couldn't help it. He was like, I don't know, something came over me, I put them in the mail slot, and you don't have to wait until your neighbor comes home, I left him a note. Oh my gosh, so I've waited all day to get my hands on these two cards. It drives me nuts to know that something is so close yet so far away. So uh, without any further ado, I'm going to open these cards. All right. they're, they're a little bent, but no biggie. Oh man, I like the look of the back of these. I like these really retro kind of classic card looks. Ooh, oh, this is beautiful art. Look at that. Oh, whoa. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on here. Let's find out. This is the kid. Don McFarlane era. Look, look at that. That is crazy. Got a nice venom. No, no, no. It's Spider-Man in the black suit. And a bunch of, like, monstrous looking people. It's rad. Oh, nice! So the X-Force crowd here. Uh, I think that's Feral, uh, Warpath, and Shatterstar. I love this. Oh, oh, oh. And a teeny tiny Spider-Man. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Black suit Spider-Man. Nice. That's a nice card. Oh, I love the, the Tom. I actually, I love Tom McFarlane art. I love the 90s. And I love Spawn. I love Youngblood. I love Image. Um, golly, it's fantastic. It's so expressive. Oh, I didn't think to get this this in the same pack. The red suit. Um, let's put the black and red one next to one another. Oh, this, this is dope. It is. I'm so lucky. Alright, that's actually it. That's the first pack. Wow! Those cards are way cooler than I thought they were gonna be. <laughs> Yay! Um, the Avengers cards opened. They were bad. I, uh, I got some X-Men 94 cards. They were really cool. Um, I actually just opened an entire case of Silver Surfer cards today, too, but I didn't plan on recording that because I was just couldn't wait. I've been dying to build, build a Silver Surfer collection set. So I ended up getting two and a half sets of uh, the case of Silver Surfer and foil cards. Anyway, oh. Yeah, a checklist. I'm so glad that I managed to get a checklist card. Are you kidding me? Two checklist cards? What? I, I hope they didn't jit me on on card count. They. they did. Oh. Alright, so that's my little bit of disappointment. I got two checklist cards in one pack. <laughs> ah. Well, whoa, speaking of raw, this Wendigo. Nice. And, uh, ooh, this is very dark, dynamic. Wendigo battling there. Cool. Wolvie and a Spidey. This is classic for any trading card set. It's a nice <laughs> tangled up Spidey. He's about to trip himself there. I'm gonna go. <laughs> and a lizard. Nice. I like the lizard card actually. It's really cool. This is beautiful. It says look out for hollow foil cards. I got one. And it's fantastic. I actually have some of the hollow full Silver Surfer cards in my pocket too. Um, here's a um, a nice, so here we have from the Todd McFarlane set, and here's the Jack of Hearts from the Silver Surfer set. Look at that hollow foil. Like, oh. Such a nerd. <laughs> Alright, well, that was it for the Spider-Man set. I'm pretty pleased. Um, let me just show this one off real quick. This is... Um, the one, one of the cards I really wanted from the entire case of Silver Server cards was the Magus. I love it.
that. Infinity Gauntlet. Beautiful. Well, um, that's it. That was, um, 1992 Todd McFarlane era Spider-Man cards. Radical. I think you should order some, but be wary, you might get a checklist. <laughs>